Now, I'm going to go to my y equals. If you remember correctly, y equals is the top button here. So I'm on it, y equals. I want 3, and I have x squared. So here's my x button again, our variable. And then you can just hit square. This is in your left column. 3x squared, it's minus 6x, and then plus 4. Smiling or frowning again? Smiling. Hit the graph, you can see it. Here's does it look like this. Hit zoom 6. Zoom 6. I have to play with it. Figure it out. Okay? Now, go to your table. Where's table? Second, and then far right, top row. Oh my gosh, look at my table. That's awful. How can I get to zero right away? You can go to second, and you can format, or I can go to second, table set. What would you hit to get there? Second, table set, which is the window button. Now, see where in the top it says table starts at 48? I want it to start at negative 5, we'll say. So I'm just going to put negative 5. Now I can go back to my table, and the first number at the top will be negative 5. Do you see your vertex here? Well, I don't. Do you see it on my table? Not until I go down. How do I know it's my vertex? It repeats. It's because we start repeating. Absolutely. So I found my vertex to be 1, 1. What's my axis of symmetry? X equals... And what does x equal in my vertex? One. Goes, remember, the axis of symmetry goes right through the vertex. What is this a minimum or maximum value? Minimum. minimum. What's my minimum value? One. How low did I go? I went all the way down to one. Now, those of you that your batteries on your calculator went dead or your little brother or sister stole your calculator to go pick up people that they like. Let's, let's do this real quick. Now, can you identify your ABCs? A, B, C. It is. Do, re, mi, A, B, C. One, two, three. Baby, you and me, girl. Man, I get better all the time. Now, I know. All right. We got to find the vertex. Can you identify the ABCs up here? Yes. Yes. What's your A value? A equals 3. B equals negative 6. And C equals 4. The sign in front of the number stays with it. Okay? Any problems with the ABCs? Travis, stop playing games. <laughs> Silence means I was right. So, ABCs. Now, you can find the vertex by remembering just a little saying, I guess. Are you ready? Opposite of B over 2A. Opposite of B over 2A. Opposite of B over 2A. That is how we, whoops, I'm over here. That's how we can find our vertex. All right, you ready? Opposite of B over 2A. Oh, I know. Tess got a little, she's starting to dance with me a little bit. Wow, that must be a good song. Opposite of B over 2A. Anybody want to know how you find the second component? Think about how you would if you, if you were forced to. That would be a good guess, but no. <laughs> now we'll go with a very quiet, silent song. Are you ready? Plug it in, plug it in. That was awesome. Hey, hey, I don't hear anybody else competing with me. Well, let's hear you sing better. Go. Exactly. Yeah. You ain't doing nothing. Plug it in, plug it in. Look at that, I get better. Every 
every time I get better. So you will see me write PII. What's PII stand for? Plug it in. Plug it in. So what in the heck does that mean? What did we say the vertex was over here? We said it was 1, 1, correct? Okay. What's the opposite of B? 6 over 2 times A. 6, that is equal to 1. That is your x value of the vertex. How do I find the y value? Plug it in. Plug it in. Plug it in. So what does that mean? I come up here. 3 times 1 squared is 3 minus 6. That's negative 3. Negative 3 plus 4 is? There's my second component. I've got my vertex. Now, if I give you just the vertex, here's the vertex I want you to work with. Million, here's quick questions. Are you ready? Here's my vertex. What's my axis symmetry? Uh-uh. X equals what? Whoa, whoa. Zero. I heard it right back there. Negative three. Those of you that say X equals two is a liar. What does X equal? Negative three. What's my... I'll tell you this is a minimum. What is my minimum value? Two. My minimum value is two. Man, did you spray? Yeah. Okay. All right, so max or min values, the y component, x equals negative three. I know it's embarrassing, isn't it? He had some issues earlier today, stomach. Okay? All right, what I would like for you to do, H. Find me vertex, AOS, max min value, and give me a graph. Ready, go! Smiling or frowning, first of all? Frowning. Frowning, all right.